<clears throat> Enough smoke for one day. How's it going? Kate, okay, yes. What am I doing here? <sighs> it's a long story. Are we going yet? Can you walk? <clears throat> I'd like to, but... <sighs> Don't move, Hans. I'm going to find a way to get us out of here. Casket gives me the creeps. Hmm, it's kind of steep. But with the sled, I could slide. Nothing I can do. It's locked. Hmm, it's kind of steep, but with the sled, I could slide... What, Kate Walker? Let's go. Yes, Kate Walker. We must be quick. No! Do not go! <gasps> no! You must stay!
that was some ride, huh, Hans? Yes, it was real fun, Kate Walker. Really. Hans? Mm hmm? Hans, do you think we can carry on with our journey? There's just a spot of work I haven't finished. You'll have to help me, Kate. Of course. What can I do for you? Tell me. I have repaired the clockwork heart for the horses, but I'm too tired, too weak. Can you go to the cabaret and fit it instead of me, Kate? It's all right. I'll go. Don't worry. Get some rest. Right! Now jump! Jump! Right! Now jump! Jump! Right! Now jump! Jump! Dang! Get out of my sight before I stuff you in the oven, you dumb goop!
This looks like some kind of sled. There must be some way to get it down. All I needed. This dumb machine's packed it in. Malka? The train left without me. Do you think your friend has abandoned you? No. I think somebody made him leave. Hello? This is Oscar, Kate Walker. Oscar, but where on earth are you? Is everything okay? These gentlemen told me you no longer wanted to end our journey here. That you want to return to America. That the train was quite capable of starting. Oh, Kate Walker, I fear I have committed an impardonable error. Is Hans with you? Yes. Ivan and Igor have confined Mr. Forelberg to his chambers. Ivan and Igor? Are you saying they've sent the train rolling again? I fear something dishonest is afoot, Kate Walker. Dishonest? This is a daylight robbery. Those men have bagged the train and kidnapped the both of you. I'm experiencing a sensation of uneasiness, Kate Walker. You've nothing to fear, Oscar. I'm coming to find you. Tell me where the train is headed. Straight ahead. We haven't crossed a single junction. I will hold our speed to a minimum. I believe I can slow them down. Maybe even... Me? No, not at all. I... I was talking to myself. Why, yes! Yes, I... Oscar? Oscar! Well, he doesn't look too smart, but still, he's kind of cute. He's come back to where he's happiest. Whatever. This place is deserted. Well, you're the only one here that likes these candies. So then, you're a Yuki. Now, let's see if you want to follow me.
Yuki, come back here. Kate Walker, the ivory's ours. You blubbery belly hog. Don't come this way. Can't you see you're too heavy? to melt this ice. dog does exactly as it pleases. Such a big forest and so little dry wood. Down, boy! You're scaring the poor beaver. Hey, Yuki! Come back here! That dog really needs a leash.
3.30. What the hell is he doing out there? Ah, Canton. Where have you been? I've got better things to do than wait for phone calls. I'm in the boonies, Mr. Marson. But things are looking good. I've got good reason to believe that Kate Walker is right here in this village, or at least in the immediate vicinity. Find her, Canton. Bring her back. Whatever you have to do, but bring her back here, understand? Your money's on me, Martin. I can't reach the branch. Hello? Kate! Katie Munchkin, it's your mother. Mother! Oh, I've been worried to value Munchkin. When are you going to stop this gallivanting? You know your boss is looking everywhere for you. I'm not coming home, Mom. Katie, this isn't what you set out to do in life. You know that. Things change, Mom. Things have changed. Oh, my Lord. Katie, have you gone completely mad? Maybe. I'm not sure. My God, Kate. Bye, Mom.